Hi, um, in this video I'm going to show you how to use our new brow stencils that, we were, that we've, we've now launched. Um, but as you can see I've done my makeup now. This is my evening look. Um, I've cleared away any excess with my um, concealer. I put some concealer on wherever I needed to. Um, and I'm going to put my brows on. Now we do have a brow pencil as you know and brow gel. But these are our, our brow stencils. Um, before you use them, I suggest you just brush your, um, your eyebrows into the shade, natural shape in a line. Now, when you get your stencils, you get five different stencils. And this is kind of what they look like. They're really floppy and sort of plastic, so it doesn't break, doesn't go brittle. And you've got um, numbers one through to five, and they're all different sizes. Um, and widths and thicknesses and shapes. Okay, so there's one and there's four. I'm trying to show you how you can see. It's quite difficult to see the differences. But the way you do it is you put the the, the brow um the shape on your eyebrow and see if that fits your your eyebrow properly. So that was number one. Um, I'm trying to think which one. I think it was number four. Was number four too, no, number four is too wide. I think it was number one that suits my br shape bra the best. So I'm going to put it on and shape it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the brow um, stencil on one eye and I'm going to do the natural on the other eye so you can see the difference. Um, so to use um, the stencils, you can use one of our palettes, uh, our pigment pots rather, the matte brown pigment pots, depending on the shade of your your eye. I'm going to use our palette number one, which are warm brown colors. Um, and I'm going to kind of use a mixture of chipper and forthright. So let's see there. So kind of a, a bit of chipper, a bit of forthright. I don't want it too dark or too, so I'm going to, um, I think I'll do this one and I'll, I'll put the stencil on that one. Or oh, no, I'll do it the other way around. Okay, so. Short little brush strokes. Okay, so that's the one done. And I've done this, I'm quite good, at, good well practiced at doing this, so. Um, that's not too bad, but now I'm going to do this. So you'd put it on your eye, eyebrow, okay, and you'd basically just colour in. It's quite difficult to <laughs> do it in a small mirror and while you've been videoed, actually. So you just colour in the stencils. Now there's a wee... Um, gap in the middle. Sorry, excuse my big rubbery arms. Um, there's a wee gap in the middle. But we'll fill that gap in a minute. You'll see it will. But if you're not sure how to shape your eyelash eyebrows, this is a really, really good way to do it. Right, so there, can you see that little gap there? So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to pull that in. Right, so there's the one from the stencil, which I really like, and there's the freehand. I much prefer the stencil. So I'm going to try and fix this one. So you just turn it the other way around. Okay, and there they're done. So I really like those, highly recommend them. They're not very expensive, seven pounds something, I think, and they last a long, long time. And if you've got a friend who's got a different eye, shape, that brow shape to hers, you can split the cost and share the stencils. Right, and now I'm gonna put some lippy on, but because I've had, um, I've got quite intense eyes, I'm gonna go for quite a neutral color. So I'm gonna do, um, I'm going to use one of our new pencils. Oh. I have so many now that they don't all fit in. Sorry. And this is um, called Plush. It's well used already. And it's kind of a, a neutrally colour. 
and it goes really nicely with well to do. Now, when you put in your lipstick on or your lip liner on and you've got quite thin lips, go on the outside of the natural eye. Natural eye, natural lip line. Okay, so I put my lip liner on and I cover my entire lip in and then I will put my lipstick on. And I probably should have looked for my lipstick first. Got it. This is well to do. And there we go. If you want a bit more colour, we've got lots of different lipsticks. What I wanted to show you though, if I can find it now, or my um, we've got a new lip brush pencil. Right, this is our new lip brush. Okay, that's what it looks like. And the nice thing about it is you just open it out, you just pull it so you pull it apart. Okay, so you just pull the bits apart and you load your lip, you load the lipstick on there. So I'll just get a lipstick. As they said, it's ritzy. You just load it onto your lip brush before you're going out. So you've got loads on your lip brush, and then you just close it, put it in your handbag. You don't have to worry about taking lipstick with you. During the night, you'll just open it. I never know which way it's coming out. There you go, you just open it, and then you've got your lipstick on your lip brush, and you can reapply. Okay, right, that's the finished product. I will take a, cell, uh, a still photograph and put it up, and um, hope you like it. Thank you for watching.